Joe Zinkus from YoChicago.com. I'm in East Pilsen this morning in a light-filled space with Brian Guzman from Coldwell Banker. We're in a, uh, a duplex down just over 2,300 square feet and as they say the difference is in the details. Wood burning fireplace, gas starter, you know, nice shaker style kitchen with a crown piece uh, on the top, a glass front corner cabinet. These are Orchard Hill cabinets, so not uh, standard. The space has mostly a traditional feel with some transitional finishes. The crown molding throughout the first level. It is wired for sound. So we're walking into the master now, one of four bedrooms. Uh, all the closet doors are wood with molding. Every bedroom has a uh, tray ceiling. The master bath has dual sinks, stand-in shower with a built-in bench a separate jacuzzi tub with a nice little pocket of glass blocks to bring in some light but also give you some privacy. We're downstairs in the uh, massive family room of this duplex. We are uh, open to below, so it's a two-story light well facing west. Great afternoon lights. We have a beautiful picture molding uh, surrounding the fireplace. And um, continuing on along the family room, there are some beautiful glass front cabinets, again with the crown piece. There is a beverage center and a wet bar, and there is a massive amount of storage in this lower level. We have uh, two bedrooms on the lower level, both tray ceilings, another bathroom, and a laundry room. I want to invite you out, take a look at 18th Street. There's been some reshaping in the neighborhood. The iconic building, Thalia Hall, has been re-envisioned and Dusex du and Punch House are open, as well as Modern Cooperative, Bellies, a couple of vintage stores you might want to check out. So if you've been looking in South Loop, West Loop, University Village, I invite you to take a look at East Pilsen, a lot of things uh, going on, like we said, on 18th Street. You're not going to get this for the price that we're listing it for in those areas, that's for certain.